The programme is aimed at targeting um, teenage mums. They have no other criteria apart from the fact that it has to be their first time baby and they just have to live in the area. What does that picture say to you? What are they doing in the picture that makes you think there's a bond? Building a tower, but it's like, they look really comfortable around each other. Yeah, fantastic. All these young parents, I haven't met one that doesn't want the best for their child, that doesn't actually want to be, you know, um, the best parent. However, it's having the, the skills um, to be able to achieve that, isn't it? And that's where I see our role really. really good. Um, <sighs> so, so, I thought the next bit we could do um, are what's called the five steps of floor time, yeah. okay? Lucy, she's a really, really... Um, bright girl um, with her I recognize that she actually works well by doing things and Mark as well he's he's very good at doing the activities and, and really seems to enjoy them you know what I mean it's nice to know that there is people out there that are willing to help and support you I really enjoy seeing how well she's growing up <laughs> learning that so quickly we work basically in trying to improve their self-efficacy so looking at improving their confidence as themselves or and, and as parents, um, looking at their life course development, looking at their goals, looking at their health, their parenting, their relationships, involvement with community. So you're really trying to promote that sensitive, responsive parenting. What do you think you might be watching for? Um, in case they hurt themselves, obviously. And also to right, see how well they're learning. So. Absolutely, fantastic. It gives me like a way to let off steam sometimes. It helps me understand how my baby's working, how she's developing over time, and what different things I can do with her. Basically, they help us bond closer together with Lexi. Same same sort of thing, really. I just think it's like helps you bond and get closer to your baby. Isn't it? It's unbelievable that even you know in this short period, I've really noticed. Um, difference with it with the clients that I've been working with and play with them. The family nurse partnership to me makes a difference yeah. to a child's life. Absolutely amazing. Once I'd completed um, my degree I worked in the community as a district with the district nursing team um, in Lowestoft which I really enjoyed and I liked the aspect of the home visiting and the relationship you're able to build up with a client um, which is very different obviously when you visit them in their own homes as opposed to the hospital. Um, so I did that for a while um, and I decided, I, th I then worked in occupational health for a little while um, and then decided that actually children and families was really where I wanted to be. Um, so there was an opportunity came up to train as a health visitor so that was for a year at master's level, which was really tough. Um, lots and lots of work, a mixture of theory and practice, obviously, half and half. Worked as a health visitor in Great Yarmouth. Um, really enjoyed that, Meet it, you know, meeting lots and lots of different families. There's a huge variety of people in, in Great Yarmouth. It's a great place to work. Um, lots of challenges um, that people face here, obviously, with employment and the economy and... Um, lots of intergenerational um, patterns forming. Um, so really enjoyed that. Looked into, in, funnily enough, into the Family Nurse Partnership. I researched it when I was um, studying as a health visitor. Thought it sounded really fantastic. Was really quite interested in the work of the family nurses and, and having that intensive working and build, being able to build up that therapeutic relationship with a client I thought was just amazing. Um, so there was um, obviously an advert for this post um, that came up so I applied for it straight away, didn't have second thoughts at all, just I was lucky enough to be accepted.